Page 148. Unit 15. Get ready. Words. A. Listen and point to the words. Listen again and say the words. Push. Pull. Movement. Ground. Throw. Speed. Heavy. Light. Easy. Push. Pull. Movement. Ground. Throw. Speed. Heavy. Light. Easy. Page 150. Read. Forces and movement. We see things move every day. We see people walking, birds flying, and leaves falling to the ground on a windy day. Things move in many ways. They move up and down, right and left, and over and under things. Look around your classroom. What things are moving? Force. A force makes something move. A push is a force, and it moves something away from you. We push people on swings. A pull is a force, too, and it moves something toward you. We pull things in wagons. Can you name something you push and something you pull? Movement. A small force causes a small movement and a big force causes a big movement. When we use a small force to throw a ball, it doesn't go far. When we use a big force to throw the same ball, it goes a long way. It is easier to move a light thing than a heavy thing. We can move a toy car with a small force because it's light. We need a big force to move a real car because it's heavy. Speed. Speed is how fast things move. Some things, like a train, move fast, and some things, like a tortoise, move slowly. Can you name some things that move fast? A force can change the speed of things. When you push a door with a small force, it opens slowly. But when you push a door with a big force, it opens quickly. The next time you see something moving, ask yourself, what force is moving it? A push or a pull? Is the force small or big? Page 153. Grammar in use. D. Listen and sing along. The horse, the tortoise, and me. A horse is faster than a tortoise, and a horse is faster than me. I'm slower than a horse, so what is slower than me? A horse is bigger than a tortoise, and a horse is bigger than me. I'm smaller than a horse, so what is smaller than me? A horse is heavier than a tortoise, and a horse is heavier than me. I'm lighter than a horse, so what is lighter than me? Page 154. Communicate. Words. A. Listen and point to the words. Listen again and say the words. Computer mouse. Stapler. Suitcase. Broom.
door, desk drawer, computer mouse, stapler, suitcase, broom, door, desk drawer. Page 154. Communicate. Listening. C. Listen. How many of these things do you have? Good morning. Today's class is about forces. Try to guess the things I'm talking about. 1. This is something we push and pull. We pull it to open it, and we push it to close it. But it's not a door or a window. We put things like pens and erasers in this. What do you think it is? 2. Now this is a thing we push, but we never pull. You need this to work on a computer. It's also the name of an animal. Do you know what it is? 3. Sometimes we push this, and sometimes we pull it. We need to use a force if we want to come in or go out of a place or room. Four. We usually pull this, but there are big ones you can push. We use this in our homes and school to keep them clean. Maybe you use this at home or at school when you help your parents or your teacher. Five. We always push this and we always push it down. We can put a lot of papers together with one little push. What is it? 6. We always pull this with one hand. It can be heavy, and it's a lot easier to pull it than to carry it. You use it when you take a vacation or visit your grandparents. D. Listen again and match. Good morning. Today's class is about forces. Try to guess the things I'm talking about. 1. This is something we push and pull. We pull it to open it, and we push it to close it. But it's not a door or a window. We put things like pens and erasers in this. What do you think it is? 2. Now this is a thing we push but we never pull. You need this to work on a computer. It's also the name of an animal. Do you know what it is? 3. Sometimes we push this, and sometimes we pull it. We need to use a force if we want to come in or go out of a place or room. Four. We usually pull this, but there are big ones you can push. We use this in our homes and school to keep them clean. Maybe you use this at home or at school when you help your parents or your teacher. Five. We always push this and we always push it down. 
we can put a lot of papers together with one little push. What is it? Six. We always pull this with one hand. It can be heavy, and it's a lot easier to pull it than to carry it. You use it when you take a vacation or visit your grandparents. Page 155. Communicate. Speaking. E. Listen and repeat. Then practice with your partner. Use the words in the box to help. Phew! I can't move this. It's too heavy. Let me help you. Thanks. That would be great. No problem.